as of two minutes ago, at least as of two minutes ago from filming, uh, Mexico has confirmed its first two cases of coronavirus. Uh, and by the way, guys, give me a like, give me a share, give me a thumbs up or something, because really, honestly, reporting things in an adult manner, uh, YouTube really hates that. I don't know. I guess YouTube believes that you're a bunch of children and you can't make your own decisions and they must be the guardians of your thought and must protect your gentle little ears from the truth. Heaven forbid somebody should dare report the news just as the news, am I right? So let's read this. Mexico confirms its first two cases of coronavirus. This is from krqe.com. This is my local uh, New Mexico news channel. Mex uh, Mexico's assistant health secretary says the country now has two confirmed cases of the new coronavirus. Hugo Lopez Gatel said Friday that one of the patients is in Mexico City and the other in the northern state of Sinaloa, and neither is seriously ill. So they are showing symptoms. They do have the coronavirus, but they have not taken ill. So they probably most likely will recover from it. However, from stories earlier today, we know that even having recovered from it or even having been cured in some way, shape, or form in a hospital and cleared uh, as a woman in, I forget where the story said she was from, was cleared. Uh, she had gotten over it and she recontracted the disease. At least five family contacts have been placed in isolation, he said. One of the men had contact with someone who had traveled to the northern Italian region, where that country has seen a local outbreak. President Andres Manuel López uh, Obrador appeared to downplay the seriousness of the COVID-19 virus, saying it isn't even equivalent to influenza. Hmm. Give it time, my friend. Give it time. Influenza has been around for quite a long time. It has been able to propagate the world round. And when it strikes, it strikes in places that it has already been established. Coronavirus isn't established in these places yet. It is still spreading. Once it is done spreading, then on a year-by-year -year basis, as I have reported earlier, they fully expect this to be like the flu happening every year. Then year by year as time goes on and it isn't spreading but it is already spread and it pops up in these places seasonal as flus and coronaviruses tend to do then you can compare it to the influenza right now it is an unfair comparison influenza has had years to propagate and be in the places so when it pops up it doesn't have to spread it's already there it pops up pops up pops up pops up pops up all around the globe at seasonal times coronavirus is just now making its debut it's just now making its spread it's the new kid on the block you can't compare it yet give it two or three years then once it has settled down into its normal rotation then we can say this is how it compares to influenza right now doing that is downplaying it and that's not what you should be doing so anyways just a really 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 quick one for you and uh yeah Please help me out with YouTube's algorithm. Please give this video a share. Please give it a thumbs up or some sort of other uh, engagement. Uh, I love you guys. Stay informed, and I will see you on the next one. And I like to try to keep these brief for you guys. That way you guys can get on with your, your days. Your time is valuable to me as well, but so is the idea of informing you. And also so is the idea of really kicking the snot out of YouTube's algorithm and just, like, being victorious over the damn thing. Anyways. I love you guys. I'll see you in the next one.